AutoCAD 2012 has revamped the way that we can work with the user coordinate system in our models by interacting more directly with the UCS icon. And we'll be seeing some of these possibilities in this series of videos. The first thing you're going to notice is an entirely new functionality which allows you to simply click on the UCS icon and expose what are called multifunctional grips. Now the UCS icon is not the only entity where you'll start to see multifunctional grips, but it is a great place to get acquainted with the feature. So essentially what you do is just click on the UCS icon and then whenever you go over a controlling point, you'll see a context sensitive menu here that gives you the kinds of options that you can do upon the UCS icon and affect the UCS system itself. Please notice that always the top option, in this case the z-axis direction, would be the default response. So if you simply just activated the gripping point and took off, you'd be actually modifying the z-axis direction in this context. Next you'll notice a right-click functionality which allows us to simply get into the types of UCS options we've been acquainted with in the past we just get there quicker and get our job done with fewer clicks and picks. Towards the bottom of this, we're going to have the ability to start modifying the properties of the UCS icon via the dialog control here. And then via right click functionality, we'll look at some features like naming and recalling the UCS. So we've got a few things to look at in this series, just a, uh, a new and more productive way to interact with the UCS system by doing more things with the UCS icon here. So we'll dig in and have a look momentarily.